Hey, what's going on people out there? This is Chris here with another another movie review. This time I'm talking about this movie called A Springtime Morning by Marion Dora. Uh, this is a short film by Marion Dora. Um, in the 90s, I think uh, all the way to the 2000s, um, he made these short films. And I think he called them Blue Snuff. It was a collection called Blue Snuff Films or something like that. I was reading up on this and I found, uh, I think it was like four short films here on YouTube. So I'm gonna talk about A Springtime Morning. So this is um, one of his longer short films. Uh, most of the short films I found were like maybe six to 10 minutes, but this is the longest one I found and it's uh, it clocks in at about half an hour. So we have half an hour in this movie. It's kind of like you're watching, uh, it's, the it's the weirdest thing, man. It's kind of like you're watching um, Faces of Death. Like if you're watching Faces of Death, but if you mix in with like, uh, maybe like something you would see like in a nature documentary or you know how you see these uh, documentaries where it shows like um, trees and like the weather. It's very, very weird. But uh, yeah, this movie has a similar tone to uh, the, the film Angels of Melancholia. And um, like the music is very similar to that. The, the movie opens up. So we see... Uh, there's these fields, we're out, out in the country, there's these fields, and we see the sun rise. So, we see the sun rise, and you see, like, the weather, the clouds. It's very atmospheric, uh, a lot of atmosphere. And then you, you start to hear these uh, very uh, chill music, some piano. Sort of like some classical music, kind of, you know, like, like that, so... So you kind of think, oh, well, this is kind of, you know, it's very chill. We're watching nature. We're watching like uh, these flowers. <laughs> we're watching, you know, very chill. It's a very chill vibe we're getting. And then maybe like uh, five minutes into the movie, um, we, we zoom in on this house or it's like, it looks like a cabin or whatever. And then you get to see inside the house and it actually turns out to be uh, where they um, embalm dead people and uh, where they, you know, where dead people go and, you know, the coroner or whatever you call it, uh, they dissect people and they, you know, prepare them to, you know, uh, cremate them and all that. So it's very, very, uh, like, random and th the scene is very, like, it's like it kind of gives you like a false sense like oh well it's not gonna you know we're not gonna see death or we're not gonna see anything but yeah it, it, it's a Mary and Dora movie so there's always gonna be nature and death combined I mean that's like in most of his movies so why should this short film be any different you know but yeah we see dead people getting cut up you know getting embalmed and all this other stuff and yeah that's most of the movie um so it's something like you would see in an autopsy video or uh, faces of death video, you know, nothing, nothing different from that. So yeah, man, we got that. And then maybe like towards like the last five minutes of the video, we have, we get to see the whole kind of how it started. Like we get to see nature again and we get to see some rain and then that's pretty much it. We cut off. Uh, end credits and yeah so um yeah man this is a I don't know if I could say this is the best of, of the short films but it was very interesting and it's totally Mary and Dora all the way like it's very similar to the Angels of Melancholia but he, it was kind of different though and I, I kind of you know I was like I was a little intrigued by it you know um do I recommend it yeah I mean if you if you're into, you know, something different and if you kind of like are a Mary and Dora fan, then yeah, I would recommend you guys watch this. Um, 
if uh, seeing uh, dead people autopsies is all that offends you, do not watch this. Um, if you want, if seeing dead bodies offends you, don't watch this. Um, so it's yeah, it's for for those kind of people that are you know into Marion Doris films. And if you're not familiar with him, don't watch this. Watch something, you know, uh, well, I guess you could watch this movie if you want to get into Mary and Dora movies. But, yeah, I would say, uh, yeah, check it out, man. I thought it was interesting, though. But I'm kind of curious to see more of his short films because um, I hear there's, like, at least, like, 30 that he did. Or he did a lot of short films, so I kind of want to see all of them, but... Some of them, what I heard, you know, that I heard, I might have to pass on. But yeah, if you want to see something different, uh, nature, death, check it out, man. Peace.